Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. Let me to start with a question. How many times have you wanted to have Business Central documents in a Power Apps? Invoices, purchase orders, and so on. Hundreds, I'm sure. Guess what? You aren't the only one. My name is Roberto Corella and in this video I'll show you a short demo about how to use the new functionality in the Business Central Connector for Power Apps. Let me show you how it works with attachments in sales quotes. At the screen, you can see a small Power App with a PDF control with a, an input text control to introduce the number of the sales quote and two buttons. First one is to show the document in the PDF control and the second one is to download the document. Of course, we need to power automate flows to obtain the documents from the business central. This is the business central where we have the, the, the orders, the, the, the quotes, and we're going to try it. For instance, we introduce a number. In this case, we have these numbers. Let's go to try with the 1002 and to see the document. And after a moment, we receive the document and show the document in the uh, PDF control. Here you are. And if you want the other one, we can see the other one. In the same way, when you press download document, the app creates a copy of the document in a OneDrive and download the document in our computer. Let's go to try it. Here you are. Pay attention in the layout of each document. The document number 1001 is this layout but if you introduce the number two, view document, we can see another different layout. As you know, we can define different layouts for each customer. For that reason, we can see different designs in the PDF control, even though both of them are sales quotes. Before finishing, an extra bonus. We are talking about attachments, but as you can see in Business Central, we are in Business Central. Let's go to the info panel and oh, we don't have any attachment in any of the documents. The connector creates the attachment if you don't have one. Sounds good, right? Thanks for watching this video and please, if you have any question, drop me a comment below. See you in the next video.